Hey everyone. Hey everyone. Wolf Vortex here. Back again with another video. Now, in today's video, we're going to be taking a look at Southampton's 11 if they never sold their best players. I guess we should just jump into it. Um, So, we're going to have the starting 11, and then we're going to have the bench, and then we're going to have the manager, and then we're going to have some honorable mentions. Not really. I don't really know if we're going to have some honorable mentions. We'll see. It depends. In goal, we'll have Paulo Gazzaniga. He's not really up to par with the rest of this team, but Paulo Gazzaniga is still a really decent goalkeeper playing for Tottenham. When Lloris is out, he's reliable, so he's our goalkeeper. In right back position, Nathaniel Klein, who is playing at Liverpool. When Klopp first came in, Klein seemed to be the pick of the bunch for the right back position. Then he got injured. They brought in Trent Alexander Arnold, and Trent Alexander Arnold was just superb. And Klein has since not been back in the team. The center back positions we have first Toby Alderweireld, currently playing for Tottenham. He was out on loan at Southampton once, and he is a phenomenal player for Tottenham. <laughs> Sorry, you're going to notice a lot of Tottenham and Liverpool players in this team. Of course it'll be Van Dijk. Who else? Who else but the best center back in world football? Virgil Van Dijk used to play for Southampton, now playing for Liverpool. In the left back role, we have Luke Shaw, who is currently at Man United, doing pretty well after that horrific injury. And then in the midfield, we have one Alex Oxlade Chamberlain. I think this team is going to be a, like a 4 4 2. Yeah, flat. Wanyama and Oxlade Chamberlain will partner each other. No, Lalana and Oxlade Chamberlain will partner each other in the midfield. Both decent midfielders for Liverpool. On the left hand side, we will have a certain Sadio Mane. I mean, who else on the left hand side besides Sadio Mane? On the right hand side, we're going to have Gareth Bale. And up top together, I mean, Gareth Bale is just so good. So, so good for Real Madrid. It's weird seeing a Welsh player out in the uh, foreign. And then we got Jay Rodriguez up top with Dusan Tadic, who is currently a superstar for Ajax. Now, the bench, we could have players like Theo Walcott, Callum Chambers. The backup goalkeeper could be Artur Boric. They had center backs like Dejan Lovren and Callum Chambers. Players like Morgan Schneiderlin also on the bench, Graziano Pele. Good players, good players. And the manager, it's obviously got to be Maurizio Pochettino, former Southampton manager. Then he was managing at Tottenham, got sacked earlier this year. Brilliant manager. Would love, him at, would love him at Arsenal, personally. Probably not going to happen, but I would love him. But yeah, I mean, it's a crazy team. Crazy team. Uh, next Tuesday, I'll have an Ajax one for you guys as well. So that's the end of it. See you later. Goodbye. Oh, wait, I should. Honorable mentions. Um... Not really anybody, really. See y'all later. Peace. Gotta fix my eyebrow though.